Did you know that your body has hidden doors, gateways that connect vital systems, helping you breathe, eat, and even hear properly? These are called additus, and they could hold the key to understanding how your body functions, or malfunctions. Stay with me, and by the end of this video, I'll reveal something about these secret doors that could change the way you think about your health forever. Welcome back to the channel, where we dive deep into the wonders of human anatomy. In today's video, we're exploring Adidas, a term you may not have heard before, but one that's crucial to understanding how your body works. Whether it's the passage between your throat and lungs, or the connection between your middle ear and skull, these entrances play pivotal roles in daily life. But here's the kicker. If these additus malfunction, it can lead to serious health issues, and you may not even realize that this is where the problem lies. Imagine if these secret doorways get blocked or inflamed. What happens to your ability to hear, breathe, or digest food? Stick around to find out because what we're about to reveal could help you recognize early signs of trouble before it's too late. Let's start with one of the most important additus in the body, the laryngeal additus. This is the gateway that connects your pharynx, or throat, with your larynx, commonly known as the voice box. The laryngeal additus is like a bouncer at a nightclub, carefully deciding what goes through and when. Here's how it works. As you eat, your epiglottis, a leaf-shaped flap, closes over the additus, making sure food doesn't go down the wrong way and end up in your lungs. Sounds simple, right? But consider this. If the timing between the epiglottis and additus is off, even by a fraction of a second, it could result in choking or, in worse cases, aspiration pneumonia, a dangerous lung infection caused by inhaling food or liquids. So next time you're munching on a snack, Think of the intricate dance happening between your epiglottis and the laryngeal additus. How often do we stop to appreciate these invisible heroes working around the clock? Now let's travel a little higher, into the head, where we find another important additus, the additus ad antrum mastoideum. Sounds complicated? It's basically the entrance between the middle ear and a cavity called the mastoid antrum, located in your skull. This opening is small, but don't let its size fool you. It's critical for maintaining the health of your middle ear. You see, the ear isn't just a hearing organ. It's also filled with air. Yes, air. That air needs to flow freely between the ear and the skull. And guess what? The additus ad antrum mastoideum is that secret passageway, antrum. Here's a real-world scenario. If the additus becomes blocked due to inflammation or infection, which is common in people who suffer from chronic ear infections, it can lead to pressure buildup and pain. This blockage may also result in hearing loss or, in severe cases, require surgical intervention. Let's dive deeper into that scenario. The additus ad antrum mastoideum is lined with a mucous membrane, which is vital for keeping the ear healthy. However, when this membrane becomes inflamed due to infection, typically after a cold or flu, problems arise. The additus is connected to the mastoid air cells, and together they act as a ventilating system for the middle ear. Now imagine a situation where the ventilation is cut off. With no way for air to circulate, fluid can build up, creating the perfect breeding ground for bacteria. This is where those dreaded middle ear infections come from, affecting millions of people worldwide every year. Did you know that middle ear infections are one of the most common reasons children visit the doctor? In fact, five out of six kids will experience an ear infection before their third birthday. But here's something you might not know. Adults can suffer from them, too, especially if there's an underlying issue with the additus. Our next stop on this journey takes us deeper into the body, to an area known as the omental foramen. Once considered an additus, this passage was reclassified because of its unique function. 
Located in the abdomen, the omental foramen acts as a doorway between the abdominal cavity and the omental bursa, a lesser-known pouch that's critical for digestive health. Its job? To help facilitate communication between these two areas, almost like a messenger between different parts of the abdomen. So why was this once considered an additus? Well, the omental foramen is more of a passageway than a connecting door, which led anatomists to reclassify it. It may sound like a minor distinction, but it has huge implications for surgeons who need to navigate these areas during complex abdominal surgeries. By now, you may be wondering, why does any of this matter to me? Well, Understanding the role of aditus in your body is crucial because these small, often overlooked openings can cause big problems. From chronic ear infections to potentially life-threatening conditions like aspiration pneumonia, the health of these gateways affects your quality of life in more ways than one. Being aware of how these structures work can help you identify potential issues early. For example, Frequent ear infections or difficulty swallowing could point to a problem with your aditus. This could lead to faster diagnosis and treatment. So, what's the key to keeping your aditus healthy? Regular checkups with your doctor or an ENT specialist, ear, nose, and throat, are essential, especially if you're prone to ear infections, breathing difficulties, or swallowing issues. Proper hydration and avoiding infections through good hygiene can also go a long way in protecting these crucial openings. There you have it! These hidden doorways, your aditus, might not be visible, but they play a massive role in how your body functions. If you've ever had an ear infection, choked while eating, or experienced abdominal pain, your aditus could be the secret player behind the scenes. Be sure to take care of them! If you found this video helpful or eye-opening, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and share this with someone who might benefit from this information. And don't forget to drop a comment below if you've ever had issues with your throat or ears. Let's start a conversation. Thanks for watching, and until next time, take care of your body's hidden doors.